You know, I'm a little confused. Why am I speed boosting and not losing adrenaline? Uh, does anybody know what's going on? Can somebody help me out? Well, I'm gonna help you out. I'm gonna teach you how to do this. I'm gonna teach you how to speed boost without losing adrenaline. Look at this, bro. Look at me, bro. Look at me. If you guys need any sports jerseys, pristine jerseys is the place to go. They have basketball. They have throwback jerseys. They have the short shorts from 2K and they have football and baseball. Link in the description. I don't want to waste anyone's time. I made this video super short for you guys. If you could just like the video as like a returning the favor type of thing, I would really appreciate that. So I'm going to teach you how to speed boost with without losing adrenaline. And I'm gonna show you how to momentum without losing adrenaline as well. So for anyone who momentums with the right trigger, when you momentum, this is what happens. You will do it and then lose adrenaline. Well, there is an easy way to not lose adrenaline. You can spam it, you can combo it, whatever. So how you do it, I already explained it. You have to cancel it out of a move. What do I mean by that? I mean by spamming the momentum constantly. You're not letting the momentum finish. So anytime you do a momentum, do a move out of it to pretty much just don't let the full momentum animation finish and you will never lose adrenaline when you are doing a momentum. Now, what most of you guys are really here for, how to speed boost period without losing adrenaline. Now, before that, if you have not checked out my other content, what are you doing? You will not regret it, I promise. If you do like it, drop me a sub. If you don't, you don't ever have to watch my channel again. So how to dribble without adrenaline. There are two ways to do this. The first easy, obvious way is doing your combos in place. You do not lose adrenaline if you are just staying in one place. Where you lose adrenaline is when you speed boost out of those said moves. But I have a way to work around this. As soon as you hit your speed boost animation, you're gonna take one dribble and then stop. So you're kind of canceling the adrenaline part of the move, if that makes sense. To break it down for you, as soon as I see my guy start to speed boost, I just let go. Like, I do not want to let the move finish out, even though it visually is finishing out. But by the game mechanics, it's really not, which is why you're not losing your adrenaline. To dumb it down as easy as possible, you don't want to let the move finish out. Go in the pro -Am arena and practice and then watch me go crazy on this build. That video is on the screen right now. And if you have any questions, I answer all comments on every video I have. Have a good day. Go out. Bye.